Okay, so it's been a good month since I've actually made a video. And I realized that the last video I uh, posted was me uh, meal prepping, and that was last night. And I was wearing the same shirt. This is my Lady Gaga shirt. It's very comfortable. Very comfortable. I feel like I just did a Donald Trump thing. Comfortable. Huge. Okay, so, uh, it, hi. Oh, hello. Hi. Yes. Okay. It's Friday, the 8th of March today. Uh, like I said, I haven't posted a video in a month. And I was getting too hung up on the editing and trying to do a thumbnail and trying to do themes. So, I'm just going to vlog. I'm just gonna, cause I have a lot of thoughts up here. I have thoughts. Don't I? I have thoughts. Right. I don't need to take him to the grave, right? Right. Justin has gone with me every single day. Uh, he's walked on the treadmill twice, I believe. Uh, he mainly goes to the gym and shoots hoops. Thursday we went and shoot. I went with him and, you know, and then today, I did my hardest workout. <laughs> I did six minutes on a, because uh, I wanted to do 30 minutes all together and the treadmill that I'm doing is only 24 minutes. So I did six minutes on the bike and then I did 24 minutes on the treadmill with two pound weights because I was talking to, I don't know her real name. I can't remember her real name. I just know it's fighting for fitness on Instagram. Anyways, uh, she did her first because she normally does her workouts in the pool, and I'm I'm working up to doing the workouts in the pool because I don't want to be out of breath. I, you know, I'm, you gotta work up slow. Anyways, uh, her and I were talking, and I was like, "Do you know what to do with your hands?" She's like, "No, I don't. I just like grab the rails." put them by myself so I was like I need to do something with my hands because even when I'm not doing a video I talk with my hands always have pretty much always will I don't know why I think I get it from my grandfather because my grandpa used to talk with his hands a lot too so it's just a habit but today I got two pounds yes two pound weights and I did an incline of one and a half at a speed of 3.1 for 10 minutes. And then I did an uh, incline of five at 2.5 2 speed for the rest of the minutes until it went to cool down and then went cool down. And then I did five more minutes with the weights and then I did cool down and I did long stretches so my back wouldn't hurt. My shoulders have been really tense lately and they go up my neck and my head and poor Justin has to rub my head. He's probably getting annoyed with that, which I don't blame him. <sighs> mm. uh, what else? Oh, I got this yesterday. I don't know if you can see it because I don't have a fancy thing up there. But uh, it's supposed to help with hair. So. And I think I'm going to break down next week and buy some dry shampoo. Um, as you can see, my hair is up right now. And it's really greasy. The joys of PCOS. You do have greasy hair. So apparently dry shampoo becomes your best friend. Uh, my mom gave me a sample one time and it was in like this little package. And it came with, I opened it and they, I swear to God it came up with a cute... It looked like a Q-tip. It looked like one of those, uh, you know the candies that you lick the stick and then put it in sugar and eat it? That's what it looked like. I didn't like it. It made my hair more greasy. So maybe like if I get a spray, it'll be better because it's kind of like hairspray. And then Lauren said on one of her videos that it adds volume and I don't want to have 80s hair. I don't want to be looking like I need to be in a white snake video. But I do need some kind of oomph. Uh, when I get to my first goal weight, which is 215, 
and that's 25 pound weight loss. I am going to get my hair cut and my eyebrows waxed. See my eyebrows? They're a little... I'm going to have to make a video and tell you the lovely story of the love and hate relationship I have with my eyebrows. I am kind of jealous of Lawrence because she's got such a gap and I'm like, why? Why? How do you get... You have such a gap. But hopefully I can make more videos. Hopefully I'll get more into it. <coughs> that was a horrible cough. My bad. Oh, things are changing. Uh, so I'm excited about that. I'm still still working out. Still on my diet. Trying to do better at the portion controls. Kind of let it get away with get away from me in February. February, I felt like I was gaining and losing the same exact five pounds, which can happen in diets and uh, changing your food, but this month is gonna be different because I, my, my second goal weight is 190, and I wanna be down to that in July because one of my friends is getting married, so I kinda wanna look nice. I don't wanna outdo the bride, because this woman deserves this man, and he's good for her. He, he balances her, which balancing her is very difficult. <laughs> so he does a really good job, I think, by what I have interacted with her and her telling me about him. I haven't personally met him, so yeah, I've known this girl since she was a freshman in high school, so, and she's at heart, personality, she is Detroit, and I am not that Detroit-ish. I may only live an hour and a half away from Detroit, but I'm not like her, but I wanted to look nice for the wedding. I bought a dress two years ago, yes, two years ago, last year, two years ago, June, yes, two years ago in June, and it fit okay, but I think... If I lose more weight, it'll it'll fit where I need it to fit. And but I'm not just doing this just so I look good for the wedding. I I want to change. I want to get out of this body. I have been big all my life, <laughs> all my life, and I don't need to be you know skinny mini because according to my height, the height weight ratio, I need to be between 120 and 99 pounds ain't happening. I'm sorry. So I just, I just want a little bit. I want to be able to go, the, okay, this, this is funny and, and I know I've talked about this in my non-scale victory goals, but I want to be able to walk into Kohl's and find a cute outfit 